Hello, welcome back to the channel. Yes, I've got my sugar skull shirt on today because I feel like it. Um, speaking of sugar skulls, I did buy a couple more sugar, well, a couple more sugar skull related items. I got a Katrina and a Katrina. Um, they're on the shelf with the um, got a uh, baby goth boy, the other goth boy. I put him away for now. Um, and. My Zaps Voodoo Heat character doll that I did. Oh, and the Halloween cat. Because he just sort of fits the situation. Anyway. Where was I? Oh, yes. It's hot and sticky outside. And I wanted to get some more cold drinks. What I had, the beers aren't going to last until next payday. So I decided to get something else. And very apropos of choice because, as everybody knows, Jimmy Buffett passed away recently. Um, rest in peace, Jimmy Buffett. You're up in Margaritaville. <laughs> Don't have any Margaritaville margaritas, but I do have Cayman Jack Margarita Pack. That rhymes. We have... Mango, watermelon, regular margarita, and strawberry. Nothing spicy, so I will just grab one at random and try it for you. And then the other ones will be reviews as well at some point, as well as two more Valhalla teas. I have a Mud Puppy Porter review up. Well, not up. It's in my hard drive on my phone, getting ready to be uploaded. And I'm currently uploading my review for Doughball Cookie Dough Whiskey. So I have that to look forward to. And Monkey King? No. Yeah, Monkey King. Teen Pajamas. And because we're getting close to Halloween, I will the next one I will do in order will be Santa Muerta. So she will be the next one. Although I could save her closer to Halloween. Because Day of the Dead, maybe no, actually I will save her because Day of the Dead is closer between toward the end of October, if I recall. Although I'm not saving her till October. I always like to do, do the teas as soon as I buy them. So I will we'll do Lo ah, we'll do Loki and then we will do Santa Muerta. And next paycheck, I am going to order some teas from Figments. Like I said, it's a tea shop I used to frequent. Well, not all the time, but a couple of times I went. And I always wanted to go to their steampunk event, but never had the clothing or the time. Although, again, I could have made the time and taken the time off. But, well, my store that I work for doesn't always like to give weekends off. So, anyway, be looking for some teas from Figments. But first, we will have, I will order teas from Figments. But first, we will... Do Loki and Santa Muerta, and then have the teeth teeth from figments, and I will try to get some more Halloween stuff for you as well. Okay, what we have here? This is fruit juice and agave nectar. Mmm, very nice. I like came and Jack margaritas. Oh, it's made with strawberry juice. And it's... Yeah, 5% ABV. So it is drinkable and sessionable. And these and the 1800 margaritas are my favorite. But for as far as so far, I believe margar as far as margaritas in the can, I think these top all the other ones I've re reviewed on here. I've had Cayman Jacks before, but I've only had the original. It tastes like a high-class margarita because it has the agave and real fruit juice. Mm. 
no news to report uh, other than the buses don't run here on Labor Day, so I did manage to schedule a cab for tomorrow. So that's that. Um, I believe I've already told you about going to Lum Yep, the Insights of my sister. That was a couple weeks ago, pretty much now. Um, she bought me some, brought me some groceries that my niece left behind. Um, slow news. Nothing new on the home loan front as well. So I guess we'll just wrap this up and make it a short review. So again, we have Cayman Jack Strawberry Margarita. Malt, it's a malt beverage with agave nectar and strawberry juice. So it doesn't actually have tequila. Although it, do, it does taste like a margarita. I'm surprised it surprisingly tastes like a margarita. Namely because of the agave nectar, although it's made with malt liquor, which is, which is fine. Um, so yes, for the fact that it's made with malt liquor and agave nectar, this is one of the best margaritas I've had so far that are pre-packaged. Because again, the agave nectar and the, all in the real fruit juice is what makes it taste like a margarita. I highly recommend you get the, the, the margarita pack while you can get it because usually they don't have, I haven't seen the other flavors running around loose. The only ones I've seen running around loose are the original and sugar-free. If you want to go lose weight while having a margarita, by all means, please try it. Uh, some of us should watch our weight, but if I'm going to have a drink, I want it to have the full effect. <laughs> Although I do drink hard seltzers from time to time for the lower calorie. But I want them to taste good too, and I've done several on here. And as you know, they hit. Ooh, excuse me, they are hit and miss. But that's not the point. So give this, give this a try. Buy the twelve pack. Try all the flavors, and let me know what you think. Um, if you want to subscribe, hit the notification bell once. If you want to see me in your inbox. I keep wanting to say inbox. I keep thinking email. You know what I mean. If you want to see what I'm doing and stay up to date with whatever I'm recording and uploading, hit the bell a second time for notifications. That's what I mean to say. Bleah. Um Share these if you wish. Again, you know, if you like them, give them a thumbs up. So, drop Drag responsibly. Drag, don't drag and drive. Let the other monsters drive the hers. And since this is his last vacation weekend of the summer, kick back, kick back with some margaritas, your large umbrella, and your 100 SPF, and have a wonderful time. I will see you in the next video. I love you guys. Bye now.